Hi guys, Technoli here, and today I got another short video. Um, this is about using the Radeon RX 5700 XT. It's an MSI version. Yes, I know, MSI everywhere. Um, and it is a super nice card, so I got all excited and I plugged it in because I had my RX uh vega 56 in there i plug it in and i'm like this should just plug and play right well let me show you what happened so i'm booting up my computer right and everything's wonderful and i'm like oh okay so so far so good this is beautiful i got all my stuff i'm gonna go ahead and boot And I'm watching the text go by, and I'm all excited, and black screen. Black screen of death. I'm like, oh my god, what is this? Easy fix, guys. Okay, so what we're going to need to do, guys, we're going to need to use Clover Configurator to mount our EFI hidden partition on our hard drive I'm sorry about the resolution I'm gonna get a new card don't worry a new a new uh, capture card but I just want to get these videos done open up the partition okay let me close this down so it's not in our way all right so I've got it opened up now we're gonna go into proper tree proper tree dot command and we're going to open it and we're going to open our config.p list on our EFI partition on the hard drive, not on the thumb drive. We're going to open it up. Okay, now let me minimize all this stuff and get it out of the way. Now we're going to go and minimize these until we get to and VRAM and if you remember when you were building your config.p list you had these boot args right here we need to add something really simple so I went ahead and saved the text right here we need to add this little thing so go over here double click Put a space bar between them and then copy that text into it's a g d p mod equals picara okay and just change that and now go out of here and make sure that i save it Okay, all right, so now when I restart, it works perfectly. Now, what's strange about this is on the Intel i9-9900K, I didn't have to make this change. It just worked plug and play right out of the box, took out my old card, put in the new card, and voila, everything was wonderful. It was only on the Ryzen system that I had to do this. So I thought that was a little bit strange, but hey, this is the Hackintosh world. Everything happens. Okay, guys, there it is. There it is. And I'm going to prove to you it's plugged in and it's working wonderfully. We got our transparent bar and about this Mac. And there it is, Radeon RX 5700 XT 8GB. Just wanted to show you this because I don't want you guys to get into trouble with you putting in an RX 5700 in your computer and it's not working. That's the fix. Easy, easy. And we are ready to go. Thanks again, guys. Please like and subscribe. And we'll see you on the next video.